Hey guys, so I woke up a wee bit ago. I'm still in the middle of getting ready. So today Becky and I are gonna go on a little staycation, vacation. She has an appointment first, so she's gonna go do her appointment while I'm still getting ready. But I wanted to show you, you guys know that I have been doing a lot of like therapeutic coloring of mandalas. And I recently bought more markers and I wanted to show them to you. This came with a free sketch marker pad. That's actually kind of cool because I didn't even pay for that. They just gave it to me. Oh my gosh. And this is like a little thing that you can wear in your hand. This is professional. Here is the bag that the markers come in. But actually, I don't know the brand. <laughs> I just opened them. Ah! You guys, this is a dream. Oh, why am I putting my face in them? Ooh, what are these? I have no idea. Are these just two pens that came with it? Dang, this was a deal. This was a steal. And then it also came with this. Smooth writing on the surface of different materials. This is neat. But this is what the pens look like. Oh, I guess the brand does touch new. There is a skinny tip and a chunky tip. And look how cute. This one's called Cosmos. I uh, love it. Also comes with this. I think this is actually the blender. All right, you guys. So I am ready. I just put some stuff in the car. Pillows, my duffel bag. Becky is getting her fan and her suitcase. But yeah, I bring pillows and my own blanket. I'm really weird about hotels don't judge i've just seen a lot of like what do you call them like experiments <laughs> where hotels really don't change out the sheets or wash them after every person has their stay so it creeps me out but any hoozle for me i'm super excited for this becky and i need a little getaway but it breaks my heart to leave my fur babies especially Twinkie because she has separation problems. I'm just very grateful that Eric and Ricky are willing to watch them for this time. I wish I could bring all three of them with me, but Becky and I are staying at like, not a fancy hotel, but it's like a little bit more expensive and they don't allow animals. So that sucks. First stop, we need gas. And we both haven't ate all day today because we know Lexington is a place where they have food that we don't really eat. Like. I am craving Mediterranean food, so I'm probably gonna have that today. So I told myself I'm not really gonna eat, but here I am gonna get some beef jerky and a Diet Coke. Beef jerky because it's like protein, hopefully it'll fill me up, hi. And then a Diet Coke for some caffeine situation and there's no like calories. So, sorry for the beeping, but I do wanna document this, that I don't know if it's the medicine that's working, but I have been wanting to go to Lexington for a very, 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 very long time. Probably a good seven, eight months. I've wanted to stay in a hotel and just have this, you know, fun time with Becky. And I didn't do it. I couldn't do it. I'd plan it and then I wouldn't follow through. It was like my depression and I don't know what it was. Mood swings. I don't know. But the fact that I'm doing it and I'm like excited for it. That's not a feeling I'm used to, and I really think that it might be the medication that's helping me. Y'all, I might complain that I don't like Kentucky, but look how beautiful it is. You have no idea. Becky loves Kentucky. She's obsessed. <laughs> it's just gorgeous. It's gorgeous here. I it mean, is. I know that it's gorgeous in other places, but it's like, it is pretty here. Look at it. Like... That is the first thing I noticed the first time I ever was in Kentucky was, wow, it's pretty. And it has really big rocks and a lot of trees because I've never had that anywhere else I've lived. Like rocks like that, just everywhere with these beautiful trees. I love it. So we're currently in the elevator, floor nine. Not very happy about that. I'm kind of scared of heights, but got all our stuff. My duffel bag broke, so I'm not very happy about that. Ooh. Oh my god, night floor. That's scary. Come on. Big Bertha. 
This is heavy. <laughs> Y'all, I'm laying on the motherfucking bed. <laughs> it was torturous getting up here. But if you guys have ever heard, oh my God, this angle is probably like crazy. If you guys have ever heard of the Rupp Arena in um, Kentucky, it's where they have tons of concerts. Like Ariana Grande, when is she supposed to be here? November. November. That's so cool. So that's where we're staying actually. It's a really really nice hotel <laughs> a little expensive but yeah i'm just chilling on the bed like girl <laughs> we just ordered food becky's getting pasta from a place called pasta garage and i'm getting my mediterranean food it's like a chicken kebab and there's gonna be veggies i am so excited there's gonna be rice i'm starved so i'm actually filming a whole video like what i'm eating on vacation vacation okay um I don't know if that's gonna be up before this or after this, who knows. But yeah, I just needed to take a load off for a minute because that was a long drive and <sighs> lugging the little buggy thing in here was hard. And so we got here pretty late, so we didn't wanna do anything. We're gonna like do stuff tomorrow. And one of the things that I am most excited for is going to Target, going to Target. I am so freaking excited. I'm so excited. Ooh, ooh, ooh. <laughs> so we've just been hanging about and um, we're actually watching a movie. It's called Greta with Chloe Moretz. I love her so much. I'm having like an allergy situation because I'm like, I don't know. My nose just feels really stuffy and stuff, so that kind of sucks. So, I wanted to show you guys the bathroom. It's cute. So, I love the lighting in here. Even though it shows true colors. I look insane right now. Oh my god. And I love this mirror. Every time I stay at this hotel, they have the bomb ass shower. Like, goals shower. But yeah. Tis the bathroom, tis me, hello, outfit of the day. I wear this all the time, nothing special. I should have showed you guys the view earlier, but look, look how pretty. I don't know why, but I can get down with a view. To me, that's pretty. Hilton's over there. I think that's the Rupp Arena over there. Really pretty lights down there. I'll show you guys what it looks like in the morning. Y'all, look what this hotel supplies you with. Earplugs. <laughs> so if you guys like blackberries, vanilla, lotion, and Bath and Body Works, you need to try this lotion. It is freaking, ugh. Like I could like bathe in this. Oh, I'm sure they have, um, soaps of it but when Becky went she's the one who got it and I fell in love with it when she went and got that I don't think there was like actual soap but it smells so good but yeah I'm just sitting in this chair I actually love it oh y'all are <laughs> I'm sorry for dropping you I dropped you because my hands are like super you know because I just put lotion on but <laughs> you guys know us big booty judies there's arms on this and i still fit like this is what it looks like i'm rather proud i mean it's kind of wide so <laughs> but it just feels good because like when you're as big as me you get worried about things like that so a lot of people have been asking about you know how far can you walk now i honestly haven't been exercising but i have been moving more so the first time that I walked and stopped watching myself, I could only walk for a certain amount of time. And I'll show you the video right here. I actually had it uploaded on April 7th. So I also walked. So walking for me is really hard. It hurts all of my muscles, mainly my thighs, but I do a stopwatch. Um, I've only been doing this for two days yesterday you guys are gonna laugh i'm not trolling this is legit i just really want to share my true struggle 
I, uh, yesterday was a minute and 16 seconds. Again, not trolling. And today was a minute and 22 seconds. So I just go until, you know, my breath becomes uncomfortable or until my muscles hurt so bad that I'm like trembling and this is just the reality right now. And then the last time I updated you guys about it was April 24th, I think. And I'll put that video right here. So as of today, <laughs> I just want to do a little tidbit. When I first started walking, I had pain everywhere. I'm talking such horrible pain and tightening in my legs that I could almost not bear to walk. So I just want to say that I don't really feel that anymore at all. My breathing is just really, really bad. And it's obviously because I'm over 500 pounds, but it's really nice to see the changes with that like how i'm not in pain like i used to be so that's a change but i did a stopwatch i didn't record myself doing it but i want to show you guys i walked for three minutes and 13 seconds that is seven seconds more than i could do before and i'm totally fine with that because any progress is good progress and just the fact that i don't feel like in pain like i used to is amazing and the only reason why i stopped is because like i feel like i couldn't breathe like i was breathing so hard becky was looking at me like are you okay <laughs> anyways though i hope you guys enjoyed this video and i'll see you in my next one bye